atomic structure and periodic table, we've got hydrogen over on this side of the periodic table, helium on that side of the periodic table. Now, helium is one of the noble gases, and let's think about what that means uh, comparing these two elements. With the hydrogen, one proton, generally speaking, then one electron. Over here with the helium, two protons, two neutrons, and two electrons. Two valence electrons, and so that way it's, it's got its full outer shell, it means it's generally happy. So now let's think about what that means as far as the reactivity of this element versus that element. Now the way we're going to check this reactivity is by holding a candle to the balloon. See what happens. Now, both balloons are going to pop, and I want you to think about what you know about the behavior of particles as their temperature will change. Now, what's going to happen to the temperature? I'm going to put the candle up there. Will the temperature go up or will the temperature go down? And then what happens to the activity of those particles? And then use that to explain why the balloon, no matter what, will pop. But other than the pop, there is something that will be different from one balloon to the next, and this will have to do with the reactivity. All right. So there's our helium. Now let's look to see what happens with the hydrogen. of the elements and those valence electrons.